Hello and welcome to Herman Hits the Road. I'm Ads. And I'm Zoe. And in this video we're at Kingsbury Camping and Caravanning Club site. Yeah, Kingsbury Water Park. I always get it wrong. And at the moment we're cycling along the canal. As you can tell. <laughs> <laughs> Got a bit, it's going a bit slow. <laughs> Morning. Charge for this, mate. <laughs> photography. No, not photography. I'm just holding a stick. <laughs> so long. Have a good day. <laughs> this is Drayton Turret Footbridge, built in the 1830s. Let's take a look, let's go up and see where Zoe is just there, look. <laughs> what are you doing? Wow, look at that view That's there. A beautiful view, isn't it? That is an impressive Ooh, view. Okay. What about the other side? Not so impressive. No. And we've got a swing bridge down here as well. We're back at the campsite, as you can see. Uh, we're just going to have a little wander around and show you a few things. Now, in that direction uh, is the water park car parking. Uh, and if you go over here, in that direction is... You can get, get to the water park that way as well. But round that corner there is the way to the canal and the pub. But that's not the important part though, is it? <laughs> We're here for the campsite. Entrance to the campsite is here. As you come through the entrance, you have the bins here. It's and general waste. General, yeah, it's no a bit recycling. weird. I don't know where the recycling is. There's no instructions about putting your recycling in these general waste bins, but that's what we've been doing. This is where you check in. You stop your motorhome or your caravan here, uh, and they want you to remain in your vehicle Okay, that's what that sign's there, it says there, and they'll come out from reception, which is just there. Now, the reception itself is uh, part of the, the facilities block. All right, so around the back of reception, in the same building, go through those doors there, and you've got the toilets, you've got the laundry room, washing up, and the information room. But around here, just around here, is another YouTuber. <laughs> <laughs> and and the uh, empty in the, uh, the the chemical waste uh, disposal point, and just across the road, across the road, just across the way from the reception and the facilities block, is the motorhome service point, and you've got a grid to just drive over and fresh water just there. So of course on the Camden and Caravan Club site you get the hard standing, and you also get the grass pitches as well, which you can have tents as well as camper vans and uh, caravans. This is the second facility block. So we've been here before, a couple of years ago, and uh, these definitely weren't here, so these are new for the camping and caravanning club. They're glamping tents. Let's have a quick look inside one of these uh, glamping tents, shall we? There you go. Oh, wow. Bed, proper beds look. And you've got a little sofa there. Kitchen area with microwave, fridge. Very cool. I don't think they have uh, any dog walking uh, sections like you find on a lot of campsites these days. Uh, but that's probably because you can just walk out of the campsite and there are loads of walks around here, all the way around the uh, the water park, you know, around the lakes, along the along the uh, canal as well. So yeah, you probably don't need it. And if you have a large motorhome oh. <laughs> with owls in it, maybe, <laughs> uh, then you can get that here as well. Roads are quite narrow to get down here, uh, but uh, wide enough for something like this huge motorhome. Let's give this campsite a rating. Mm. Um, what are you thinking? Well, first of all, let's just give it some points. So the 
the uh, facility block under floor heating, mm. right? Uh, and uh, what was the other thing? Oh, you can hear the M42 motorway. It's not loud, but it's a constant hum. I couldn't hear it over there. I can hear it here. Yeah, you can definitely hear it. And of course, oh. that's because it's right near door and right near the uh, M42. Mm, so the location's good, isn't it? We had to go buy it uh, to yeah. get here. Yes. Go buy the place to get here. Uh, mm. But yeah, so it's got fantastic location for the walks uh, and whatever, uh, wildlife, cycling. Um, but what is our rating going to be? Mm. The we've, campsite. We've, well, we haven't used the facilities, have we? Really, we haven't used the showers, but we never do, though. Do friends we? say that they're very good. Don't yeah. They, so. Staff uh, seem friendly. Um, so we're going to give it a four. A four. Or do I need to hold up my hand? Yeah, four. <laughs> we're going to give it a f four Hermans out of five. Yeah. And there's our pit, little Herman. Got our flag out. New accessory. Uh, we've got our bikes this time, and I have remembered the batteries and the keys. It's for our Johnny Burr. Yeah, and then we're right next door to this pair. I don't know why we put next to them. <laughs> this is Robin Lynn on tour. Never heard of him before, to be honest, but... Uh... <laughs> Unbelievable. We only say after us myself. You know, who am I? <laughs> yeah, who are you? Who are you? It's been a wet weekend, people. A wet weekend. No, it's been a lovely time out here. Uh, love weather-wise, isn't it? It has. Yeah. The sun's shining. What is... Good God. <laughs> oh, it's actually flying now. Look at that. Just because it's bigger than yours. Right, so this is the water park. It's one of the huge lakes that they have. And uh, we are on the bikes and the scooters down to the pub. The <laughs> Don't worry, I'll make it make, look like you're going really fast. Yeah, so up here, beyond the lock, lock number nine, is the pub. Hopefully they'll be able to squeeze us in for some nosh. And here is where we're going to be eating. Look at the scenery though, amazing. Now here's a pub car park. I wonder if you can Brit stop here. Well, that'd be great. The road up though doesn't look that wide. You can get a motorhome in there. But the place we are at is the Dog and Double. Although some people may call it the Dog and Doublet. There we go. No. There you go. Yeah, it's supposed to be, it's narrow enough apparently for people to jump across. That's yeah. why they, 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 they're they so narrow. Have a go. No, I have to try. <laughs> I don't want to try it. I've got a sore knee, haven't I? I do what? You would do it on the scooter? If I had a little ramp, I'd do it on the scooter. <laughs> So much BS. <laughs> the ramp goes over that way. Hello. <laughs> okay, so this is uh, the last day of our holiday uh, with uh, Rob and Lynn yeah. on tour. Yes. So we, we, we've really enjoyed ourselves this week, haven't we? Yes. And uh, we had a good time doing the uh, Van Come Dine With Me. Yes. Video uh, to follow. Uh, apologies that we haven't done much recording for this particular vlo vlog, yeah. but um, we've done an awful lot otherwise, haven't we? And but now it probably was would have been boring, wouldn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but now uh, the weather's changed. It's actually raining outside, so um, the camera's not going outside. If you see what I mean. But so apologies for any uh, not so much uh, footage. Uh, the canal was very nice, though, wasn't it? In the pub. Yeah, pub was a bit disappointing. Pub, pub was great location, but but and the beer was okay, but the food uh, was a bit. Nah. The food was a bit. Yeah, I think they so. chose the right word there. Uh, it was edible. It was just wasn't the best. <laughs> it wasn't cardboard, but yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's Not right. One of our favourites. 
So, uh, thank you very much for watching. Uh, until next time, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that notification bell. Goodbye. Right, onwards and upwards, and today. Yeah. That's right. Going out now, leaving the campsite. Mm. And uh, leaving Robin Lynn. Will we cope? <laughs> I think so.